uh, yeah, that. Welcome to the stream, everybody. Um, I have to um, come up with something like, you know, Joe Rogan's like, uh, what does he say? Um, he's like, uh, uh, oh, he says, uh, hello, friends, I think. And then welcome to the thing. So I should do something. Uh, like, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm not gonna say hello, friends, because he says hello, friends, right? That's that's not good. Welcome. <laughs> that's it. Just just welcome. Um, yeah. So, ho okay. I was just. I thought there was like a weird echo. Um, what if I turn on noise canceling? Maybe it's um, maybe it's better. Oh yeah, that that is better. Uh, okay. Let me just make sure this thing's working. Like always, I always do this um, on my phone. I always uh, just make sure that it's doing what it's supposed to be doing. Oh, it says busy. Hmm. All right. Well, I'm actually live, but whatever. We'll uh, we'll check back in uh, in like two seconds. All right. <clears throat> so yes. Okay. So um, yesterday, I decided to start a Twitter competitor. That was ambitious. Okay. It was a little. It's a little ambitious. Uh. I think instead, I am gonna do it. I'm still gonna do it, but I think um, Tesla's reading this thing today, and okay, so like, look at Tesla, right? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not Tesla, um, but like, but like, look at it, right? Um, it, uh, I, they, they started with rich, uh, like Lotus Elise bodies. And they just um, jammed a bunch of uh, a bunch of batteries in there. They started really small. Like the goal is to um, change uh, transportation in general, um, but um, they didn't start with that. Uh, instead, what they did was, yeah, they just jammed a bunch of batteries in Lotus Elise uh, stuff. So. I'm not gonna uh, grab a Lotus Elise frame and grab a bunch of batteries, but I think um, since, okay, so you you make a website, right? I make a website, <laughs> You anyone, anyone makes a website. Um, what what happens? Uh, nothing, nothing happens. No one cares um, about yet another website. I don't think anyone, actually now that I think about it, was there a time when anyone cared about websites? Maybe, I must've missed that by like 20 years. But anyway, 2020, no one cares. Um, you say, oh, I made a, a new Twitter. Uh, no one, no one's gonna care. So instead, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start small, very small. Um, actually, not that small, I should. So I'm not uh, sure where like to start, what like uh, slice, niche, whatever. Um, so I, I was, I was looking at this story about Tesla and how they started small, but they dream big, right? So um, that was, it was Indie Hacker's newsletter. That's what it was. Um, so to me, it uh, I should um, not start out as like a generic social network. It should either be focused on a particular topic, or if it's not focused on a particular topic. Um, it should be, um, uh, very, um, oh, this thing's supposed to be repeating. Oh, there it is. Um, so I found this music, uh, that I want to give credit to this person. Um, I don't know if you guys can see this. Hold on. Let me see if you can see it. No, you can't see it. Um, here, I'll just, I'll just put it right here. Um, so yeah, this, uh, Shiku Emoto, lo-fi, hip-hop, chill-hop, it says royalty-free, um, but we will see, uh, we'll see what happens, um, yeah, so hopefully, um, this doesn't get, uh, you know, muted, but we will, we will see. So hopefully, uh, Shiku Tomoto, if you get like a notification or something that I used, the Neighborhood Vandal, is that what it is? The name of the song is Shikumoto. Shiku Tomoto. 
the artist i think is neighborhood vandal um so thank you thank you for this wonderful music okay <laughs> um hopefully it doesn't get muted uh, all right so um what was i saying oh yeah um right so i i came up with this today um it uh it is kind of like what i'm thinking i mean it's in progress still obviously but um so I I instead of um instead of, so uh since no one's gonna care and there's not gonna be there's gonna be a few users right um no one like starting it's a chicken and the egg problem right starting a new uh thing is uh like especially when you need input to make it valuable uh it's very difficult uh no there's no con so the chicken and the egg problem is so you start a thing and you need content right you need people to make content uh but at the same time um no one wants to go there and make content because no one's reading that content um so yeah it's tricky usually you can sort of get around the chicken and the egg problem by um starting with like a famous person uh so if you're already an influencer it makes sense to make try to make your own social network um that's that's kind of like uh it back in the day um you, you would like use the internet and then you were a programmer so you could make your own website um so it's kind of the same right if you were an influencer you could take your massive following and just be like hey um i'm making a thing um just follow me on this other social network i don't have that i don't have i don't have like a massive following or anything so um for me oh i just noticed that alicia was in here earlier and i didn't know what she did but she took she took a plant out there's no more plant i didn't realize that huh all right well that one of the shelves doesn't have a plant in it um that's okay that's not that's that's fine um anyway yeah so so what i'm gonna do instead right since i don't have like a massive following and i'm not gonna get anyone using this at first is i'm gonna start um okay so i'm gonna do two things the first thing is wait oh she's gonna <laughs> she's gonna put it back I heard you. oh i didn't even see that one up there I, heard you. <laughs> I didn't even see that one though I had to water that. all right <laughs> um yeah what was i saying all right so she had to water them but now they're now they're back um she was listening outside the door like a like a creep i don't know if she's still listening but all right um so yeah i'm gonna jump start i'm gonna get around the chicken and the egg problem by doing two things the first thing is <laughs> great creeper she was listening okay so the first thing is um i'm going to uh not start with like so the content is going to come from other sources so i i have like a list of um well let me just okay let me let me back up so the first thing actually not that's the second thing the second thing is i'm gonna get personal blogs and like cool people on hacker news who like submit their stories um i'm gonna hopefully uh i mean without their permission um hopefully this is okay but i'm gonna take their titles and then i'm gonna put um links to so i'm gonna put their titles in like here right so um i don't know if you could see but th like this would be like a title right like um like uh you know uh t t top 10 um safest neighborhoods <laughs> i saw this video today <laughs> i'm not gonna say it though top 10 safest neighborhoods in um you know chicago <laughs> um and that would be that would be it right and then oh wow i really ruined this somehow like i'm not sure what i did here 
but I, de I definitely ruined this uh, arrow thing. Uh, let me just bring this back. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, this needs this little arrow needs to be bigger, and it needs to like be centered. Let me let me see. Hold on, let me see if I can do this real quick. I'm getting distracted. Oh, I should really learn how to use Figma. Okay, so arrow is here. Uh, I want to make it bigger. You know what? We'll just leave that. We'll just leave that for now. We'll just delete that. Okay, that makes it that makes it easier on me. So this this would be like a title, right? Top ten safest neighborhoods uh, in Chicago. And then you would um, let me grab this icon again because I ruined it before. Let me see, where was it? Arrows? Alerts? No, shape arrows. Perfect. This um, this little arrow right there, that guy. Um, so then this would be like here. So this, I, I, I did this, but oh, oh, I, it doesn't, it does not change the, um, the arrow size. It's interesting. So this arrow is seven by eight. Um, so it should be, uh, so it's half, so it should be 16 by 17. And then this should be 32 by 32. There we go. Now it looks a little, a little better. Not, not great, but oh well, whatever. I'll, uh, I'll fix it in the actual, the actual thing. So, so, uh, as you can see, this is looking, um, quite a bit like, like TikTok. <laughs> um, that is not a coincidence. Um, you know, that that is by design. So, um, yeah, the way, so it's gonna be two, it's, I said to me two things, I should really focus and stop designing. Um, okay, so the first thing is text only, right? Because, um, I just, I, I keep thinking about like, oh, I want to make cool stuff for people to like upload pictures and videos, but it's like, it's all moderation. Like, uh, no one, no uh, person does this anymore. Like making something like TikTok as a solo person is insane. Like there's, uh, think about all the bad content out there, right? Um, and people are just going to abuse it. Like, uh, they're just gonna, I, I have faith in humanity in general, um, but I don't have faith in an anonymous online humanity. Like, so yeah, there's, I, ugh, like no one does this because it's just gonna be a bunch of porn. Like, honestly, it's just gonna be a bunch of bad stuff that it, like you don't want on your, in your database. Um, and it's just gonna, and you're gonna get a bunch of copyrighted stuff too. You're gonna get people recording their TV screens, and um, yeah, it, it's not good. Like that is gonna, that's what it is. It's that's how it's gonna be. So I um, definitely don't want to do that. That's not something I want to do. I don't want to just be moderating everyone all the time. So text only, because you can only do so much damage with text. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's definite and it's easier to uh, to do text. I don't know if anyone knows this. It's a lot easier to make text um, stuff versus um, versus uh, like images and videos, especially videos. Like so hard to moderate. I mean, like uh, oh, these are really off. Um, yeah, let me uh, group these. Um, yeah, like TikTok has an army of moderators. There's no, there's no question. Um, they, they have like probably, I, I don't know, a hundred, ten, tens of thousands, if not more, um, uh, moderators. Uh, yeah, there's, um, it's definitely, it's definitely, um, a different, a de uh, oh, this is, uh, I should do this in the group. Uh, this uh, this freaking thing. What is it? Which one is it? It's not that one. It's this one. Oh nope, I was wrong. Okay, it was that one. Um, yeah. Just just thinking about that moderation is terrible. 
I, I can't imagine it. it. There's just people have been like Facebook moderators have PTSD. Who wants that? Um, that's why no one makes this stuff. You, like as in solo person, you don't want to make like a general um, social network. You know, you, you don't want to do that. So the second thing, right? So that's the first thing. The first thing is text only, which is sad, um, but whatever. The second thing is that to get around the chicken and the egg problem and also to um, sort of niche it down, I'm going to uh, get RS. Well, I'm going to get R. It's going to be like an RSS feed reader. Um, and yeah, so you can sign up and make new posts. Uh, but the majority, I would say like 99% of the content is going to come from like existing sources. So, um, hacker news stuff, uh, other things. And then I'm going to try to like categorize all this stuff and put it in the thing. And hopefully uh that will be like enough content to keep people coming back so um the, uh yeah so those two things so text only and then sort of like um just from certain sources uh for now um just to get it like kick-started if people actually care to uh to do this um yeah and there's one more thing um that's not like uh, about starting up or a chicken and the egg problem it's um it's that um i i i want it to be like there's gonna be rules right so <laughs> twitter like it was funny because it was famous for having no rules for a long time you could just do whatever and then over time rules crept in well it'd be better if they started with clear rules, like a rule like I would do. No politics um, at all. No, who cares? Who cares about politics? That You have Twitter for that. <laughs> so no politics, uh, no, um, no, I don't care if you're a politician, like you can't use this. <laughs> um, it's not for you. Actually, maybe I should, yeah, maybe I should niche down even more and say it's, Anyway, you, you can't you can be a politician, but you can't talk about politics. Um, no porn, no that includes everything that's bad, like all the bad stuff too. None of that stuff. I don't want any of that. Um, which you can't with text. You almost can't do it. I mean, you could do like weird ASCII stuff, but I mean, it's it's it, whatever. Um, so yeah, uh, let's see. The next thing is gonna be. Um, so no, no trolls, no trolling, uh, no harassment. There's a lot of no's. There's a ton of no's, um, but no one's going to use this thing anyway, so it's fine. But I'm just saying, if I had started a social network uh, looking towards the future there, um, that's exactly what I would, what I would do. Uh, oh, this is like way off. What? Okay, let me um, do 15 on either side on this. It's weird. This is supposed to be not 17. It's supposed to be 15, I think. No, it's supposed to be more. So this is uh, 20. Let's do, th I guess, 30. That's really in there. Let's just do, yeah, let's just do 20 here. Um, so anyway, yeah, rules are good, right? I used to think, oh, everyone's, you don't want any rules. Like everyone's like an irresponsible person and you know, everyone's just gonna be good. This guy not gonna be any trolling, what? It'll be fine. Um, but it turns out that that's not the case. Oh, what am I doing? That was weird. I thought it was kind of cool actually. Um, this sh I need to center this perfectly in the screen. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Okay. 89, 87, <laughs> it's all right. Whatever, you get the point. Um, yeah, that's not bad. Actually, this should be further away from this. Now that I think about it, this edge. Um, yeah, it should be like uh, maybe 30, right? Yeah, because it looks like you, it's like coming off the, there. Yeah, that's a little better. Um, anyway, so this is gonna be like a title, 
right? And it's gonna be like a glorified like news reader at first, I think. Um, so uh, just like TikTok, you're gonna be able to like select topics and then, uh, which there's only gonna be like a few. <laughs> um, and then uh, you can um, see, now you're just gonna see stuff and then you like swipe up for more. Um, yeah, so that's what this is for. Swipe up for more. <laughs> um, there it is. Um, and then, yeah, you get your you get your title here. That's good. Uh, oh, that's oh, I did not mean to do that. Um, yeah. So well, yeah. That looks good. Kind of. I don't know. Like the spacing seems off still, but whatever. Um, okay, so this is. Um, so then if you see it, something, a type, so it's, it, it, so it's not, it's text, it's not video, right? So um, if, if you see something that you like, um, you have to um, click this button to, uh, to keep reading, right? Keep reading. Uh, maybe I have to say like more. No, that's confusing. Keep reading. Or like uh, read, read. Yeah, that's good. It's really nice and short. Um, is that gonna change? Yeah, it did. Okay, so this should be seven away. Is that what I'm doing? I gotta, oh, I made a copy. There we go. This one's seven. Yep. Yeah. And how far away is this from the? Should be more, right? Um, what did I do? This one's 20. Oh, it's 30. That's fine. I can do that. 30. And then this is 30. Even though this should be more, it should be centered. Yeah. Um, I'll make this in soon. But yeah, so these are the controls. Um, so you have read comments, um, and then um, what else is there? There's like one more thing. Profile. Oh, the person, the author. Jeez, <laughs> the person who who did it, um, right? Because there's uh, what is there? Comments. Oh, you can like it too. Yeah. Let me see. It's like a traditional. Um, let me see. Where's do we have like a shapes communications? Um, Let's see, there's a lock. Uh, emoji. So yeah. It, oh, there is no heart in this? The bootstrap has a, has a, oh, there it is, shapes. Okay, there's, oh, there's only one heart. It's half a heart. Hmm. Gives me an idea for a little animation or something. Uh, okay, bring this in. So put that there. It's gotta be 30 away. So run out of space. Might be too far apart. You never know. Um, let me see, this is oh I made a copy again. Ugh. Okay. Best designer in the world, right there. Um, yeah, best designer. Best! I kind of wish I could make um, UIs like this, just like export. Uh, I think actually this has something, right? Yeah, it says, oh, position absolute. Yeah, nice, nice. It doesn't have like the, um, yeah, it doesn't know, right, about your constraints. Oh, it even has code for, yeah, but it's not, yeah. It's pretty good though, not bad. Um, I see the appeal of no code. Okay, so you can like it, and then, um, actually, I'm, I am going to move this up. I'm going to move this up quite a bit. The, this is kind of, um, yeah. Uh, okay, this needs to be, like, I don't know, something. Hey, 30 and 15? 
10 and 15. Okay, whatever, just center it. Actually, uh, maybe, yeah, maybe like 40 or something, because this is 375, right? Um, oh, that's the height. 54, 350, 345. There we go. Um, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this. Maybe just put it like maybe right here or something. And this should be more than that. Like, um, what's 15 times 60? Yeah. Maybe I'll just put this, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this. Maybe I don't even want that. Um, but anyway, yeah, I. this is like my second iteration on this. <laughs> I. Um, yeah, I, I did this thing and then like I was gonna have this little bit like where it this sort of hiding and you're like, oh, how can I get to this bit? And then you'd be like, oh, it's, yeah, you just swipe up. Um, yeah. Let me see, this uh, UI is not gonna win any awards, that's for sure. Uh, let me see. What am I doing? Oh yeah, profiles, jeez. Um, oh, you know what? You can upload one picture, your profile picture. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess I'm going through all the, here, I'll just use mine. I, I guess I'm going through all the trouble of all this like identity verification stuff. So I might as well let you upload one picture. Um, I'm just going to delete these. Oh, I don't think you can see this. Oh yeah, I'm like doing other stuff, sorry. Okay, here we go. Profile, bring that in. Um, it's my face. Boom. It's huge. Uh, I need a mask on that, on that face. Oh, let me bring an oval in here. There we go. Um, we'll make it like 250, 250. And then bring that, just mask it up. Oh, that's not good. This needs to be above that. And then we mask. There we go. We'll do it just like, just, yeah, we'll make it a little bigger. Um, 300. I uh, will do it bigger. We'll do it 400, 400. There we go. Okay, and then the mask group, link that, bring it down, perfect. It's still too big, 50-50? Um, yeah, let's, yeah, well, just do it the size of the icons. 30, to, actually, we'll make it a little bigger. There we go. Let's see, where is it? 27. Let's see, how far away is this, 22? How far away are these ones? 30. Okay. Oh, I made a copy. I really have to learn how to use Figma. 30. Oh, there it is. Um, okay. So this is like the person who did it, right? Um, and then here, we'll just do this. We'll do, let's we'll call it V1. And this is like V, V, V2. Okay. Um, there's a story about Steve Jobs um, making something. I forget what it was. It might have been the iPhone. I don't think it was. I think it was iPod. Um, they would make five different versions of it, uh, and they would like, or ten or something, and they would like put them all next to each other, and um, uh, they <laughs> they um, they would just go down the line and be like, uh, this one, not this one, not this one. Not. And it's like, it'd be cool if you could, uh, I mean, that's uh, the appeal of tools like uh, Polyplane or whatever, right? Um, which I thought about making this too, I was just copying this. Oh, what? No, no, it's, um, yeah, oh, here, polyplane.app. Jeez. Okay. Yeah, like that's the appeal of this, but it's the same. So not quite what I was talking about, but 
but yeah it's crazy that you would um pay for this madness um yeah, that's a lot look at what hundred dollars billed ye yearly oh wow this is super expensive um wow uh i i wouldn't even if i had a company that was making lots of money i wouldn't use this um yeah i mean you could just do it it doesn't take that much um anyway so yeah this is it right um oh maybe i'll just add a little text here here since since i'm the the one making this i'm not going to use my like first name is taken i'm just gonna say that there it is um yeah it's kind of close still maybe i have to uh less space between these let me do like 20 or something um oh this needs to be seven still it's sort of next to it yeah and then this should be what did i say 20 yeah that's a little better um yeah that's pretty much it so you click this it goes to the profile oh this should be closer i think maybe seven hmm. you click this it goes to the profile you click this it um likes the thing you click this it shows the comments uh so maybe it'll like slide up or something um kind of like a modal but uh like a drawer i don't know what you call it um this is gonna take you to um actually what is it gonna do maybe it'll open up uh another drawer thing um like from this side maybe and it'll like sort of hang off like right here like it'll hang off like here uh by the oh you can't see my mouse i don't think obs that doesn't show you mice when you're not in uh, max it uh, doesn't show you anyway i think yeah that's pretty that's not bad um okay oh and this is just uh, a straight rip of tiktok <laughs> um i think i might have got the order backwards um let me see tiktok ui uh let's look at it oh i did yeah that's bad um, not, not that it matters. Well, I'll do it just because they're the biggest one. There we go. So yeah, this is, I think this is, uh, like algorithm, not algorithm. Um, yeah, there it is. Um, I mean, yeah, I guess I can have search. I didn't really think about it. They have it though. And then, oh, notifications too. Yeah, I guess I need both, right? That's, it's going to be a thing put the bell in there bring the bell in kind of sound like bell end um which is like a whoop which is a um a british thing i think i'm not really i don't really know anything so i don't want to talk about that uh alert alerts sure it's nice to have text there but now they're really close um, let's see what else, what else? Search. <laughs> the icon, the iconography is like, the, I was reading a story about the original iconography, um, iconography, the icons for, um, for the original, uh, Mac desktop. Um, it was just like pixel art and, uh, this lady was, uh, in charge and she just, did like a great job and it stuck with us all these all these years um which is crazy how close is this to this uh, it doesn't matter uh let me group this it's probably oh gee yeah let me do that yeah using those keyboard shortcuts uh i'm gonna oh let me align with that, yeah. And then equidistant, distribute horizontal, yeah. I think if I move this outside a little bit, um, which I was like, I thought it was too close, but now I'm like, is it too close? Yeah, 
really on top of each other. Well, let's try it again. Hopefully it uh, comes up with something a little better. Not that it matters, but it's just nice to see something, you know? I think maybe the icons are just huge. Yeah, I think they should be a little smaller. Um, and this should prop new post should probably be colored or something. Um, yeah, like maybe just, just that. Um, yeah, like that. And then maybe instead of, uh, maybe we'll just do 24. 24. Because that's, that's huge. Uh, let me get rid of this stupid thing. Plus circle. There. A little better. Um, maybe I make this 14 instead. And then do that to all of these, which... There's probably a better way to do this, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing, so. Uh, let me see, 24, 24, oh, oh wow. It uh, got real big. Okay, there it is. Um, search, 24, alerts. I should stop messing around with Figma and actually write, write some code. Uh, okay, Pro, uh, people. 24. Looks a little better, kind of. Now the text is like way off. Anyway, I think I think I get the point. Um, yeah, usually I skip this step and the UI winds up looking like garbage. So it's nice to see, um, nice to see something. It's nice to see uh, what it could look like. instead of uh, just jumping in um, and having it look terrible. Yeah, it's, it's not bad. Um, this swipe up for more, yeah. I think it might, maybe it's obvious, I'm not sure. Um, and since it's not a video, this UI is kind of like, what? <laughs> like, why is it over here? <laughs> There's no text here. Maybe, yeah, maybe it's not just title. Right? Maybe it. Maybe the title is here. Um, but but yeah, maybe. Oh, 45 is probably 45 is good. Let me see. Yeah. But maybe it's. Um, you know, maybe it's. Oh, let me not I'd do that one. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe it's. Um, there is a lot of text here. Oh, this is um, bacon ipsum. Um, you give it, you give it, a, and it just comes up with a bunch of text. Um, yeah. So yeah, something like that. It's definitely looks terrible now, but, um, <laughs> yeah. I mean, what if there's like a lot of text? Um, that's the problem, right? Well, that's kind of why I settled on title, I guess, versus, uh, yeah, versus like having it be a bunch of text. And then having the text, then you get, when it comes over, then you're, then you're scrolling, right? But here, yeah, I see, I see why now that Twitter made a list. Because <laughs> it's just not that much, right? Um, even if you write, you know, 140 characters or whatever, um, it's just not, it's not that much. Oops. Let's see. I mean, I guess I could like try to fit it in here, but yeah, it's 43 away. Yeah, I guess I don't need this along the right side, but it makes sense if in a mobile context, it makes sense to have it here. Um, yeah, it also might make sense to move this up here Right. Oh, but then, yeah, then it's hard to hit. Yeah, let's look at the UI one more time. Uh, it looks like me, oh the, oh, the profile is up here. Interesting. And then heart, and then comment, and then share. Interesting. Hmm. Uh, I mean, I guess, yeah, that makes sense. That's was my uh, intuition there. My, my good design intuition. <laughs> 
Uh, I, I, yeah, just let me move this down here. Um, I'll delete that. And then... Oh, this isn't grouped. There we go. No, not 30, 20, yeah. Then I'll move all of this down here. Like that instead. Yeah. And then, hmm. Yeah, it's weird. Like all these little um, subtle cues about the UI. Like if you move this, this isn't grouped either. This also needs to be grouped and so does this one. Um, yeah, like all these little subtle cues. Like if you put like right here by your thumb, it'll probably be the most tapped one, or the most clicked, right? Or the most engaged with. Um, but if you move like up here and you move comment here, people will probably leave more comments. Um, okay, so yeah, this, you could just say it's a title um, and then titles can be as big as they wanna be. They fill this space, right? Um, or maybe it's not even a title. Maybe it's just the first part of the, um, of the thing. Yeah, maybe it doesn't even have to be up here. Maybe, yeah. Maybe it could be... Yeah, maybe it could be... Hmm. I kind of like that this is here because like the first... We'll just swap it. Yeah. It could just be um, title. And then. Um, oh, the width needs to be 340. And then hopefully that uh, can give me something. Oh, th uh, th really? 340? Hmm. Um, and then this could be more text down here. So this could be big and like bold or something. Um, ooh, a little too big. Uh, maybe like that. And bold, possible? Possibly? Medium? Oh, bold. There we go. And then this could be not bold. And it could be not that, just like 16. And then that could be lorem ipsum, right? Line that up with that. What is, what is this? 18? Let's do 15. 15. And then this could just be like this. Kind of weird reading, but maybe... I don't know. Maybe you just get used to it. Let me see. Then you wouldn't have to have that read button necessarily. How do you, uh, normal? No. Oh, I'm not sure in, uh, in Figma how you um, don't have overflow. Oh, I thought that was it, but um, auto, hmm. line height, auto height, fixed size. That's what I'm looking for. Oh, it does work. Look at that. I just copied a bunch of text. Oop. Um, let's look it up. Figma don't show overflow. Overflow content. Clip content. What where is it though? Where is clip content? Oh. Whoa, there's like a whole new world in here. Jeez. Look at all this stuff. I don't think I've ever even seen this. Um, well, whatever. We'll just make the text less. I just delete a bunch. Um, I really, uh, made a lot of text there. Maybe I'll just copy less. 
like this up to that one yeah so yeah maybe maybe it looks like this you know I don't know mm. it sucks to be text only but except for this one image <laughs> uh, I don't know maybe uh, maybe I change it we'll see I'll probably just start with that though just because it's a lot easier I mean, it's not uh, terrible. Bacon, Ipsum, uh, Delore. Yeah, it's not uh, not terrible. This should probably just be whatever the height. I mean, it will be in CSS. Oops. Yeah, not terrible. Um, hmm. Oh, 48, 45, and then what's this? Ao, 15. Yeah, yeah. It's not. Um, it's not horrible as like a news reader thing. Um, yeah, it's not. It's not terrible. Uh, I, I would like pictures and well, actually, I don't even think you can. Can you even post a picture to TikTok? I don't think you can. It, it just I kinda, it kind of makes sense though to uh, to just uh, do like a one format like it, this is just videos because I think w one of those ones um, was like multi oh there was one called Path which Path Social Network which uh, never took off um, <clears throat> let me see there was it had a really cool um, button uh, let me see wait we see the images there's a lot of social networks that never took off oh see there's just Path is closing its private social network for good. Um, stay connected with family and close friends. Yeah, how can you make money off that, right, Path? You should have uh, should have thought about that. Um, oh, there, there it is. So it was like this. Um, <laughs> oh, it it was. Oh, I lost it. Oh, well. Oh, there it is. So it was like this. You click the button, and then um, it would like fly out. It was the first flyout menu. Here, let me show you what a flyout menu looks like. No one does it anymore, really. I don't think I've ever seen... Yeah, I haven't seen one. I haven't seen flyout. Oh, jeez. Just... Oh, the camera. The camera's done. Oh, man. Uh, I think it lost battery. Let me, let me see. I don't know. They have a backup battery, so that might be it. Um, yeah, I guess if it dies again, then then we'll know. Oh, I'm out of focus. No, oh, that's all right. Let me see if I can just do it here. Oh, oh, okay. How about that? Oh yeah, perfect. Oh, I really gotta uh, make sure the battery's gone before I before I start this thing. Okay. Um, yeah, fly out menus. Let's see. Uh, yeah, not what I, not what I was imagining. Let me see. Oh, I see. I, I have a different, like, oh, here it is. Here it is. There. Okay. So yeah, you would click it and like, that's, I mean, that's pretty cool. Um, and then you would like go away. That was how they did multiple, um, types. So like you could do picture, um, whatever a person is, you could share your location, uh, some music i don't know or if you were sleeping somehow or text um yeah it's people it's two steps that's the problem right like to to share it should be frictionless and adding um that friction there uh it just to you have to do that and then even though it's nice to look at and like it's a nice animation um just just having to choose right it's not even about the two steps it's about the, the the cognitive load of choosing so that's why 
Twitter confuses people even today because you you start with text and then you can add tech you can add an image to your text that's better than like having to choose which format first right um yeah i'm not saying that's why path failed path probably failed because they didn't have a path to profitability yeah i went there um that was a long time ago when when was path even a thing Let's look at it. Let's look back at the Wikipedia. Let's see. It was a long time ago. So on September 17, 2018, announced termination. Oh, they were around till 2018. Wow. Um, oh, it got acquired on 2015 by Cacao. Cacao. Hmm. Photo sharing and messaging. 2010. 2010. Yeah, you could tell the. Uh, it's crazy. Um, uh, like. Are there any niche social networks? I mean, besides Nomad List, which I talk about Nomad List all the time, it is essentially a social network um, run by one person, kind of. I mean, it's kind of a social network. So you can chat, and there's a Climate Finder? He just adds the. Oh. Yeah, he thought that was cool, huh? Yeah. Um, anyway, so yeah, that was Path. Um, yeah. One thing I like about this UI is that the uh, branding, usually um, when people make websites, they have the logo everywhere. Um, wow, this thing is really killing my computer. Um, what, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Um, I'm kind of curious if TikTok does it. I don't think they do. Yeah. Do you notice on the TikTok UI? TikTok is nowhere. The logo is, it doesn't exist. This is the closest thing to the logo is the plus, the plus sign. That's something that, I mean, like if you go to Google, there it is, Google, just so you don't know. And then even when you start using it, right? I'm using Google, right? There it is, it's right there. Um, but yeah, and TikTok, doesn't doesn't exist you know it you tap the app and the icon and you're in it it doesn't matter it's kind of cool um yeah but i see why google does it because like if you click a link and then google's logo isn't there it could be anything because that's the internet yeah i think this is a good place to start though this might be a very um this might be a very short stream you never know you never know. Um, let's see. Yeah, it's not. This isn't bad. It's not. It's not terrible. I just, I want to move all of these up. I don't know why. It's just I want them to be aligned with this. But now you're further from the thumb, so it doesn't make any sense. Oh, move it up, man. Yeah. It's not. Yeah, it's not terrible. Um, it's definitely more boring with just text. Um, of course you can do emojis, I think, I hope. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's not terrible. I'm not sure how much I can actually realistically get done in half an hour. But I'm pretty, I think this looks okay. It's not bad. And then, yeah. A read should probably be, um, read. Yeah, I probably, you probably want to read more than you want to like engage, you know? Um, mostly because it's like the anti-social network, so you don't really care if you're going to engage. I don't know why I'm giving this so much thought. Oh, is this 20 away, not 30? Okay. I, I guess I give all my projects as much thought. Um, yeah, maybe that's why I get hired at places. Because I just overthink things. Yeah, this is good. It's pretty good. It's not bad. Not terrible. Um, yeah, it'd be nice uh, to... Oh, I said it was a Twitter competitor. I wonder if... Did Twitch ever... 
update my thing for that? I don't know. Let me see, stream info. Oh, it did. Okay, that's good. Uh, okay, oh, and the tags are good too. All right, good, good. Um, yeah, sweet. Hmm. All right. I'm not sure if I want to get started on this. Or if I just want to cut it short. I kind of want to cut it short <laughs> and get started on it tomorrow. <laughs> Well, I don't know if anyone even tuned in, but for the people watching later, it was a short stream, uh, mostly about design, but that's kind of how this goes, right? I, I feel like I, if you're going to start like an indie hacker thing, you probably don't want to do this, what I'm doing. Um, yeah, like no one, let's, let's go to indie hackers. <laughs> I'm, a social network is like the worst business because um, it's all moderation, right? And it's like never-ending moderation. Um, yeah. Looking for feedback. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, see? This person knows. Yep. It's terrible. It just, it seems like a good idea, like, oh, I can do it better, but yeah, this is mostly a tech demo. <laughs> um, so yeah, I think uh, the design is is decent. Um, I would probably use this to do things, to read things, I guess, to post things. Um, yeah. So then read. It's not bad, although let me just make this arrow lighter so it doesn't uh, stand out so much. Uh, oh, delete that. Didn't I? Oh, it doesn't add it to the group, I guess. Should be, what did I make it, 32? Whoa. Arrow again has the same problem. Um, 16, what did I make? 15, um, 16, is that what I did before? Yeah. 32. Yep. And then this text. There we go. All right. All right. Um, yes, that's not, this isn't terrible. Not terrible. Yeah. Oh, this is kind of further away. Or it needs to be further away. 10? Yeah, like that. It's probably better. Yeah. Um, it's sterile. It's definitely sterile. Yeah. I mean, the goal is to let the content shine through, but let's see. One thing I could do is like a background color, right? Um, yeah, it could be like, um, since you can't, since you can't choose, um, uh, oh, and then I would have to do, like, this would be the, like, dark one. Yeah, like that. Um, to show that it's not, um, and then I would have to, like, change all the text and dynamically determine, um, if the color is, uh, uh dark, too dark, I'd have to change the text to be light. Um, which I should have like linked all these as text and then I could have done this in Figma the right way. Oh, and then I should also have, I should also change the icons too. It means SVG. Yeah. But, 
But yeah, maybe a background color could be good. Less sterile. Um, that you can set, I guess. And then when you swipe, it changes. Yeah. Oh, that's actually... That's not bad. Yeah. One thing I also hate about social networks is the anonymity. Hopefully the... Um, yeah, this would... Uh, Actually, I'm not even sure how... Can I change this here? Oh, yeah, I can. Um, anonymity seems like a good idea, and so does privacy, right? Um, privacy seems like, oh, it's, uh, you know, part of the, you know, whatever, constitution or something. Um, which, I don't know if it is. But <clears throat> it. I think it's in a technological world... It, uh, especially on the internet, it only does, it seems to only do bad things, right? You give someone anonymity, and all of a sudden they're just doing the stupidest things that they could do. Um, they're just saying dumb things, doing dumb things. But if it was tied to their actual identity, which is Facebook tried to do this real name thing back in the day, um, it should probably be even darker, right? Like it should be something else. There, like, like that, maybe. Maybe it should be lighter. Yeah, maybe like that. Um, yeah. They tried to do this real name thing, people were pissed. But if you start the network with these rules in place, I don't think people would, would be pissed. Um, oh, you can maybe you do like a gradient or something. Just do a little gradient, right? <laughs> a little, uh, little guy. Uh, yeah, like something like this. Maybe a little more exciting, right? There you go. Yep. Just a little... Yeah, it's kind of ugly. Maybe we'll just not do that. Yeah. So yeah, maybe that's the schema, right? The database schema. It's, um... Uh... Oh, so it's users. Um... Oh, I also, uh... Fixed my Atom problems. So hopefully you're seeing Adam now. Yeah, you are. Um, so yeah, I was trying to like mess around with Vim, and uh, it's just I don't think it's for me. I like the key bindings, but um, but yeah. So for me, I would just say like, um, let's see. I'd probably move layout to the bottom. Right. So that's what I'd just do that. Oh, hello. Um, what was I doing? Oh, yeah. And then, oh, my gosh, what? Oh, my keyboard's, like, moved over. There we go. Um, move that to the bottom. And then, I would, it would be, I should really work on this, uh, but y you want to define the database here, probably. And it would be, so the schema would be based on this Figma thingy, this design. Um, straightforward social network. Users, right? Because uh, apparently they are drug addicts and that is what we call drug addicts, even though I don't like it. I, but then it doesn't matter because it's the database. Um, let's say create table users. And then that would have you know, ID, text, primary key, uh, text, what? Integer. And then timestamps, All right, a little shortcut. And then, unless you wanted to name your thing timestamps, but then true, yeah. Maybe we could shortcut this too. Um, PK true, or you can do ID PK. Hmm. Yeah, just do PK, PK true. Uh, and then um, it would be uh, name, which you would say like username. Then you could do full name. And then this would be text, not null, unique. Text, unique, not null. Um, and then you do email, text, unique, not null. And then this would just be text, also not null, right? because uh, it's not anonymous uh, and then the stripe identity API hmm. I 
Identity Verification API. Hmm. Uh, let me see. Oh, well, it's a beta. So, they, they probably give you something like uh, Identity Verified or something. Um, but I don't have to worry about that now. So let me see, and then um, we would say if the whole account is a bot, right? Um, this would be boolean, uh, not null, default, true, default one. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure if you need to do that, or you could just do default one, but yeah. Because SQLite doesn't have a boolean type, so SQLite boolean. You just use one and zero, and it's like an integer. Um, I wish there was a more uh, space-saving way to do to do booleans. Um, uh, it does not have a separate boolean store. Instead, are stored as integers: zero, false. Yeah, it's messed up. Um, so yeah, bot, and then um, you would say, or you would say re. Uh, no, you would say bot. And then, actually, this is gonna be derived. That's not even a thing, because as I was talking about yesterday, uh, the, uh, the identity verification is like a one-time thing, and you can easily just sign up with the verification and then start using the API to, or web scrape or whatever, and just start like posting a bunch of random stuff, which I would definitely do an API here. Um, just to set it apart, I guess. Um, like you could have your own um, an UI if you wanted. I because I don't really care. I guess, right? Um, it's it's a dollar free for the first year, a dollar for each every year after per per person per account. Um, so yeah, and then you know what? Instead of tying it to one person, dude, if you want multiple accounts. Yeah, you can do it. So we're gonna do something like this instead. This is you have a user, uh, but then they can have multiple accounts. Yeah, this is a better this is a better schema. Um, create table. It'd be maybe I should just say table. Right there we go. Although create table has a little something has a little something. So uh, accounts, and then I would say. Um, Again, pk true, timestamps true, uh, and then this has username, text unique not null. This does not have that. This has account, account um, reference. Maybe I can have something like db reference or something. Nah. Um, or maybe I can just say like uh, references. Hmm reference I can just say it's a reference um, yeah because normally what would it be it would be account ID integer references like uh, oh, sorry user user reference so I'd say like you uh, user ID integer references users ID right um, yeah so for this one I would just say like uh, users reference and then that would be a shortcut to this. Yeah, I'm making this API as I as I go. <laughs> All right. Uh, let me see. Oh, 950. Well, there there it was. I thought I was gonna cut it short, but and then for this, this has full name and email. Um, but yeah, you can just make as many as many accounts as you want. Doesn't matter. Um, yeah, that solves the uh, what was it called? Finsta or whatever. You have multiple accounts per user. And it's all tied back to one user. So you could you pay a dollar a year, but you get multiple multiple accounts. Um, and then what else is in this thing? Let's see. It gets tricky with the following. Um, you would just say like uh, follows or something. No, not relationships. Relationships, and then or that's there's got to be a better word for that. Let's see. Relationship synonyms. Um, connection link it's pretty pretty short uh, let's see similar words similar affinity kinship connection eh. uh, parallel tie in let's see link link relationship yeah I was already there 
I don't know, color relationships, I guess, even though it's like a very, uh, yeah, that's a very long word. I don't want to have to type that over and over again. PK true, timestamps true. Um, and then it would be, what would it be? Uh, I wonder if it ever reached some kind of scale, if it would make sense, uh, it wouldn't make any sense. Yeah, I was gonna say, I, you ran into this problem of that's why migration does exist, right? You can't just like uh, copy over the old table because it's gonna take forever. Like it would take, yeah, sometimes data is being added to the table so fast that you can't even uh, copy over to the other table. I'm talking about in SQLite, um, th there's no uh, changing column names. You can't rename. So the solution is to drop the old table, we rename the old table, create a new table with your new column, uh, and then insert into that new table. Um, yeah, you, there's... I, like SQLite, you can do that because it's supposed to be, you know, oh, there's a few records, whatever. Um, but yeah, sometimes some of these high traffic sites, like, which it's almost like, well, don't rename columns, right? Uh, that, that you're done, you're stuck, that's it. One thing you could do is make the new table and um, copy over like when there's low traffic and just sort of get it done eventually over like a month or something. <laughs> yeah. Uh, scale, scale problems, you know, I don't have those. Do not have those problems. Um, th oh, this could probably be full name too. No, no, we'll just do username. Relationships, uh, uh, when you make a new one, it's gonna be uh, the, the, the person, uh, you're gonna have uh, followed and following. Oof, I don't know, that's confusing following and followed. So the person who was followed, right? Um, so this one is gonna be uh, references. It's gonna be user ID. Oh, now I have to come up with like a separate, oh, this is why. Uh, I guess I can just say references uh, users ID, right? Um, integer, yeah, I guess I don't have to come up with anything. Integer, references, I guess reference is just short for when the, when this uh, matches the table name. So yeah, this, these do not. So there you go. There is, there's a, an advantage there to doing this. Oh, hmm. Interesting. Uh, user side D. So there's the person being followed and the person follow, initiating the following. I don't know if I'd just call it follows, right? Um, follows have a followed and a following. Uh, a followed and a follower, right? Hmm. Could be. Um, yeah, 955. Jeez. What else is in this Figma thing? The schema. Let's see. So now I have relationships. Um... So it's like a has many and belongs to it's sort of relationship thing. Uh, let me see this. Uh, you know what? This is kind of um, the follower is like when you click this button, right? Uh, to, to follow um, or something. Uh, you it probably makes sense just to do users and reference it versus um, then you could say um, followed. Yeah, followed? Hmm. Uh, followed, yeah, followed, I guess. Followed. ID? Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Followed. The person who's followed, right? Hmm. Ooh, that's weird. The uh, nomenclature there. Uh, okay, what else is there? Oh, likes, likes and comments. So I have profiles, 
followers. Um, oh, I don't have the content. Let's do let's do that real quick. Def. Um, let's see. What is this? Uh, oh, I don't have no alerts either. Alerts. Maybe create table. Um, alerts. Um, PK true. I want to call it notifications. It's just really long. <laughs> what is better? A better one for notifications. Um, notification. Is a synonym. Inform alert as alerting. Yeah. Uh, we'll just leave it. Whatever. We'll call alerts. PK timestamps again, and then what else? What else? Um, probably like some text, right? Like uh, maybe like a title is text, not null, and then like if there's a body, text not null. Yeah, I guess. Uh, let me see what else is there. There's likes. Oh, I don't have the actual content. <laughs> Jeez. Let me see. Posts, right? Okay, table posts. Actually, kind of involved. More involved than I thought it was gonna be. I should really make this create table uh, function <laughs> and like the whole thing that goes along with it. Reference. I guess I could um, reference. Is it ref. I can call it whatever I want, I guess. Uh, let's see, timestamps again, true. Timestamps are always useful. Um, let's see. And then title, text not null. Body, text not null. Actually, you can do title with no, with no body. Sure, why not? It needs to have title though. Title uh, definitely needs to be there. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Yeah. What I like about this is it's just gonna be plain text. No formatting, right? Like in Twitter you can't make things bold or italics. It's perfect. I don't think you can anyway. Let me see. Let's look at it. Let's check it real quick. I don't think I've ever seen. It's all plain text. Yep. I mean, emojis, right? That's about it. But, yeah. Uh, do I care about hashtags? I don't think I do. That was kind of a weird thing that I don't know. But I don't know. TikTok has it, so maybe, maybe we do. But maybe you can't make them. Maybe it's like Stack Overflow, where like you can't just make them. Hmm. It's interesting to think about. I guess I can just throw that here, right? Let me see. Text. There you go. Um, let's see here. Hamburger, pork. <laughs> there we go. They put those down at the bottom over here somewhere in smaller font. 16, what is this, 24? Probably 16. Oh wow, look at that. If it's 16, it's a lot, a lot better looking. Oh, it's 28, 18. Hmm. Uh, maybe 20. I don't know. There we go. Yeah, that's 16. This would probably be 22. Just throw them down there. Okay, so that adds one more thing. Jeez, this is so many tables. Really putting it put into the test. That's 10. Well, um, I'm gonna keep going with these tables, and I will show you next time uh, what what it looks, what the database schema looks like. All right. Um, thanks for thanks for watching, and I will hopefully be back tomorrow. Uh, I'm not actually sure, um, but I think I think I will be. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I'll be back, but something might come up. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, anyway, uh, thanks again for watching, and uh, I'll see you later. That's it. Oh, oh, jeez! I tried to stop just now, and it it did it wasn't cool. It wasn't a cool thing. Uh, so I'm just going to stop the stream now. All right. See ya.